Hello and welcome to the Combustion Therapy Channel. Right now I'm giving our 2007 Honda Fit an oil change and during the process I figured I'd like to show you guys how I like to use seafoam during my oil changes. This is actually the spray can believe it or not. Many of you guys would go ahead and pour the liquid inside the valve cover but I think the spray can is actually a much better value for your money and I'm about to show you why. Right now our fit is still in the air and the oil is the majority of the way out. This is the perfect time to go ahead and give it our seafoam treatment. With our new oil filter in place, but the drain plug still out, we can begin the process on the top side of things. While our oil continues to drain from the engine, we can remove our fill lid and insert our seafoam. Maybe a little hard to connect the hose and angle it in such a fashion that you can reach down underneath your valve cover. Once inside, we can look in and direct our spray at all of the different components inside of our valve cover. On some engine models, you may find a small screen which will inhibit your direction. However, you can sometimes slip the hose past the screen and move it around in order to get where you'd like to go. On a small engine like this, I like to use about half a can. reason I prefer to use the spray seafoam over the liquid can since I do believe that you're actually getting a better more powerful spray on all of the components inside the valve cover which is more likely to knock the crud off them. Many times if you're just pouring the liquid itself inside it's going straight down to the pan. No matter which seafoam variant you decide on, it's a great product and I use it almost every time I do an oil change. My reasoning behind choosing the spray can is the fact that I find it a little more versatile. I can spray it in the valve cover, I can spray it in the gas tank, I can even spray it in the air intake. It's got many uses and it serves a lot of purposes. It's entirely up to yourself whether you choose the portable or the sprayable can of course. There's not going to be much difference between both. The portable can is better to put in before your oil change, give things a chance to break up, and then let it all drain back out. Whereas the sprayable can I like to use during my oil change to help push all the extra crud down through. Thanks for watching today's combustion therapy video, and don't forget to put oil back in your engine after you have treated it.